Hello everyone, welcome back with me again in this channel. On today's tutorial, I'm going to show you the newest feature on PC Translate. So, this is the newest feature on CapCut PC. On the homepage, you'll easily spot the video translator. Let's click on it. Okay, so video translator so by using this you can easily translate your language in into uh, sorry your videos into another language with your original voice and sync live movements and here your video should be five or until 300 seconds long and your video should be steady and feature only one person for the optimal effect so here i'm going to just upload the video first you can drag and drop in here or just click on the plus button and find the videos so i'm going to use this video uh, 20 seconds long click on open and in here on the right you can select the uh, translate from so i'm going to uh, the video is on english so click on english and i'm going to translate it into Okay, unfortunately, the language uh, options, the languages options still limited. So you can only be choose between these three, Chinese, English, or Japanese. So I'm going to try uh, translate it into Japanese. Now click on translate. And here, this feature is intended for internet portion. You can just uh, read this notice. And after that, here you can just click on this to agree to the terms of service and now click on allow so it will it now is processing uh, the translation will take about nine minutes you can click go back and view the progress in recent text so you can just leave the uh, uh, this process you can click on go back but when it's done you can just click on delete your media so now my video has been translated and now i'm going to just click on the view and this is the result let's uh okay i'm going to just play Okay, so my video has been translated into Japanese before it is on English. And here is the result. So easy, right? So that's how you can translate your video in a CapCut PC. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Also, click on the thanks.